The following segment is sponsored by the Coral Arts Society of Utah. Celebrate the days of 47 by attending a Patriotic Pops concert right here in Salt Lake City. Our very own Sterling Paulson and the stars of Afterglow, Kevin and Joel, are here to tell us all about it. Welcome, you guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Nice to be with you. Thanks for joining us. This is so exciting. I'm just, I'm thrilled to have you all here. Sterling, let's talk about this concert for those who aren't familiar with it that's coming up this weekend, right? Yeah, this is actually the 72nd year of the Days of 47 Pops concert. It was started 72 years ago by Royal Danes, who is the grand, grand, grandfather, I believe, of Skip Danes, who runs Danes Music. But, uh, and we've been doing it for 25 years. So we've been doing it for quite a while. We're excited to do it again this year. We're so excited to have Kevin and Joel with us this year, Afterglow. And they're gonna do a great job of getting the audience excited and they've got some beautiful music too as well yes. and we've combined that with the orchestra so it's going to be great the salt lake symphony with dr robert baldwin conducting they're going to be there this year and the choral arts society of utah of course 100 plus uh, singers and we've been doing this concert for quite a while. So we're excited to do the concert and we're excited for people to come. So exciting, so much rich history there and That's so right. much talent. Now, Joel and Kevin, what can folks expect the kind of music or what can they, what will they see in here? There's, there's a little bit of a mix. We did some country stuff in Nashville a few years ago. We'll do some of that. And then some music that's more kind of inspirational in nature. Uh, it should be a good, good mix. It should be a lot of fun. Could you, would you? Could you, I think we might be doing could you, would you? Yeah. Could you say that really fast? Could you, would you, can I coach you? I'm said, would you want it, don't you? Yeah, yeah see, there you go. You're going to yeah. be doing some of that. Oh, you got to listen to some of those I know. <laughs> yeah. The choir's trying to learn them right now. Actually. I love it. I love it. Let's, and you guys well, have a lot of history together. Let's talk about your background, kind of, as a group with Afterglow. Yeah. Pleasant Grove, 40 plus years. Uh, so we were, we were raised there, and we were in school together, in high school. Wow. and did a lot of fun things together and then he he had a great anchor voice and I tried to put a little harmony to it and we stuck with it ever since. Yep. I love that. That's such a great story. So much history there and that partnership. That's amazing. And Sterling, as you mentioned, obviously this concert has been going on for a very long time. What makes this year different from past concerts? Well, this is the second year since COVID. So we're still trying to, everyone's trying to still get back into the groove and how to, how to make things work. And, and there's a lot of changes that have happened. One of the big changes is that our tickets are now online. So we okay. no longer distribute the tickets at Danes Music or here at the Channel 2 Studios, but we they're online at arttix.org. Okay. So you can go online and find the concert, and if you can't find the concert, go to casu.org, and the link's right on the front page, or Afterglow has a link on there, afterglowmusic.com. Okay. They have a, a link on their page, too. So uh, you can buy the tickets there. They're free. Okay. It says purchase, but they're free, and the limit is eight, uh, so get your tickets now. Absolutely. That's so great. And let's talk about who can attend the Days of 47 Pops concert. It's a family event, so family that's what event. we want. We want families there, and if you get there, sometimes uh, if you get there, you know, by 7.15, the doors will open. If you don't have a ticket, you can still get in, so don't panic if you haven't <laughs> been able to get a ticket. Uh, that the, you can still get in if there's room. And that's we have had standby lines in the past, but uh, the last couple of years, because of COVID and everything else, it's yeah. been... It's, we're just happy to see five people there. Absolutely. <laughs> we'll be happy with that. It's yes, and, and, and it's, there's three of us right here. Yeah. <laughs> It'll anyway. be such a great event. So looking forward to it. And there's so many different ways that you guys can go online and purchase those tickets. Sterling, Joel, and Kevin, thank you guys so much. Thank, thank you. Thanks for having us. Absolutely.